welcome back to CAD CAM tutorial today we are going to design a simple 3d pipe with the help of 3d sketch today we will learn how to use 3d sketch command in SOLIDWORKS I hope you like it so let's see here now we always use uh, any one of the uh, plane and uh, sketch a 2d drawing or 2d geometry in the per particular plane but here we have one more option if you will check here in sketch you will find 3d sketch it is very useful tool you can directly sketch your 3d model or 3d geometry so today we will see how to make 3d pipe with the help of 3d sketch so directly let's choose 3d sketch instead of selecting this all plane 3d sketch now we are in this 3d sketch plane so uh, first we will create a geometry so let's choose line now see you can see the arrow arrow shows you can go if we choose this point now this arrow shows you can go this way or this way so let's go any one way this way again now it shows arrow upward direction or your right hand side uh, I mean to say X Y direction you can find out in the left corner X Y Z axis so this is the our Y axis then again we are going opposite of x axis then comes down fine now here we want to change the axis or change the direction of a, a sketch so just uh, press tab key in your uh, keyboard tab see it changed the direction so I'll go back to the z axis now then go to upward direction that's fine now here also we need to change so select press tab key in key keyboard that's it that's it here also arrow with us now here we need to change press tab key now you can see the arrow is going upward oh it's tab key upward direction now here change tab that's fine here also no need to change the tab key here we need to change the tab key press tab key and connect exit now this is the our 3d sketch see we created a simple uh, is a square a box and uh, we will see now do one thing let's define it uh, we will define some 900 millimeter 1000 millimeter okay now uh, we created two sketch now we will do one thing we will just uh, make a relation select these two lines make relation parallel now select these two lines parallel fine now choose these two lines parallel select these two lines parallel relation now this one selected uh, we will go uh, this one we assign 900 and uh, let's make this line and this line equal equal means 1000 millimeter select this line and this vertical line equal equal means 1000 millimeter let's choose these two lines equal let's select these two lines equal now choose these two lines are uh, these two lines we already defined equal now let's choose these two lines fine now here this one also we need to define thousand so select equal okay now select 
these two lines equal relation and here also we need to make equal relation equal relation now select these two lines equal relation delete or we will do one thing Defined thousand, the last line. Okay. Uh, delete it. We will define at the end. Now, this one by default nine hundred millimeter. Okay. Let's choose this two line. Equal relation, fine. And now the this is the only last line balance. thousand millimeter that's it okay now see this is the our 3d sketch is created now let's define some corner rectangle a uh, corner fillet choose here fillet make hundred millimeter and we have to select continue yes select this directly drag and drop so you can it select yes 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 okay let's uh, just look once again which is balance or uh, here this one and then this one i hope the all edges are selected okay that's fine now select exit now see this is our 3d sketch now for the pipe profile we need to create one circular pi pipe profile so first we have to create a plane so just go to plane select this line any one line and this corner see we are going to create a plane on this corner this point actually not corner this point okay select a sketch now see this is plane one is selected and here a sketch and draw one circle a smart dimension 100 millimeter exit now hide this plane now our path and profile both the both things are ready feature swift boss base first i'll choose path uh, sorry profile and second choose path now here you will find one more one more option thin feature if you select thin feature you can convert it into a, a thickened pipe from here you can change the direction of pipe inside or thickness inside or outside i'll choose inside outside okay now see this is a beautiful 3d pipe here we learn about 3d sketch i hope you like it uh, let's give some color go to metal nickel brushed nickel see it looks a uh, nice metal color even you can give some dark red oh that's fine see so this is the simple use of 3d sketch command i hope you like it don't forget to share and like our video and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solidworks thanks for watching